boom what is up guys welcome back to another video this has been a part two video a year and about two months in the making welcome to the official part two of burn down operation burn down tennessee we did the first one back in august of 2022 it was one of the greatest weekends of all time but hmm uh, yeah, that's actually true. We're out in public. We just left a CVS. If you know, you know. We got just some goodies. Yeah, we got some goodies. I can't tell you what, um, because we're struggling right now. Like, we're life is good. I would say, I would safely say that life is objectively good. But me and Cameron, particularly me, maybe a little bit of Cameron too. Woo, what's we, up, guys? We, we got some stuff that we had to get to help our help our health. We're struggling. Uh, help our health and help yeah. Canyon's health. Yeah, Canyon too. We got some stuff for him. We got a nice cabin though. We just left Dave and Buster's. We're going to the cabin here in a second to wind down, drink about a hundred Coke Zeros a piece tonight, and then stay in the hot tub till 3 a.m. Coke Zeros are overrated. Most overrated soft drink of all time. That's crazy. Anyways, Coke Zero, please sponsor me if you're watching this. We're gonna go to the cabin, show y'all a tour, and then have some hot tub deep thoughts and conversations. So stay tuned. What is up guys? Here's the official Trevor Wester vlog tour of the cabin. Here we go. Live in the flesh. Got Cameron. Hey, got, got some of the gang. Got some of the gang back here, but here we go. Here's live tour. So, first off, me and Cameron's room. I don't want to show too much. Um, Cause yeah, it's just, it's a bunk and we got Cameron. What's up, I'm Cameron. And, nice you. Yep. We got a closet. Oh, what's in it? Court hall. Court hall. whoa. Wow. Okay, we got all right, we got five fragrances, and we we're only here for two days. Say less. All right. Bedroom. Oh. Oh, baby. Coke Zero. Um, bedroom, yeah. bathroom. Bedroom, bathroom. Typical standard. Dining table. Christmas tree. Wow. Wow. Christmas, Merry Christmas, guys! It's not even the second week in November. Here, All right, we're going to the top, the tippity tap. Yeah. So we got a little bit up here. I really like this scenery. Hundred percent going to be in a devotional coming very soon to you all. Cameron again. Cameron again. I know no one cares. Okay. <laughs> we got a beautiful view. There's a hot tub outside. We got the master bedroom up here. And uh, I think this is everybody's favorite part of the house. Got a heart-shaped bathtub. And I love you to the mountains and back. Wow, that's so sweet. Um, wow, that's beautiful. So inspirational. Oh, um, and oh, uh, we forgot about the fireplace, cabin, TV, heart-shaped bathtub. Pam. And Pam, shout out to Pam, so inspirational. We're gonna go back down. We're, we'll have to go to the hot tub, have some uh, intellectual conversations because it's gonna be exciting stuff. Um, yeah, Coke Zero hot tub. It's all coming up very soon. But this is our happy, happy home for the next two nights. All right, guys, really exciting times. We got my boy Cameron out here. We got Michael here. So oh just so y'all know. We just had the police called on us. Um, three cop cars pulled up. Um, I posed the wonderful question to my viewers, or to my viewers, to Cameron and Michael. I was like, look. Shirt is missing. It's mine. I wasn't aware of it. If y'all had, I asked if they had three wishes from a genie, what would those three wishes be? And the next thing I know, the 5-0 pulls up and has a noise complaint. Like, come on now. I understand that God gave me a very beautiful gift when it comes to my vocal cords. But I didn't realize it was 5-0 worthy. Come on now, chill out guys. Chill out, chill out. Call a noise complaint at nine o'clock? Yeah, what are you doing? Yeah, yeah. Are you 90 years old? Even, even justice for Canyon too. My boy got pulled over for going 69 <laughs> and a 60 on the interstate like a month ago. Oh, Come so on. Honest. Yeah, <laughs> it's, it's, no, it's not better. Justice, justice for Coke Zero. For justice for the Tennessee Volunteer 2022 football team. Hen and Hooker, you know, um, yeah. And just justice for this trip. Like, come on, guys. We Come on, man. Good morning, guys. Welcome to day number two, Saturday, November the 11th. Happy Veterans Day. Um, 
We are about to go, I guess, go get breakfast at the Paula Deans, the island. That's going to be super, super good. I'll probably walk around. I know we're shopping until we drop. So until one of us gets called by our uh, credit card provider and our car gets shut down, we haven't bought enough stuff. So we're going to be going ham today. We got Cameron here. Uh, I think me and him and Kenya are going to have to go back to the Polo factory store and get some more deodorant, even though this goober is still running on the same bar deodorant from – a year, a year and two months ago. So. I'll wear deodorant, by the way. Yeah, he he wears Doctor Squatch now. He's he's a new man. Um, but yeah, we're ready to go. We like we said, got out of the hot tub last night. Just kind of chilled out. Everybody's kind of tired. Just kind of laid there, watched TV. Canyon. Yeah. Yeah. So super excited. We're gonna eat till we uh, just fall over. Yeah, puke, fall over, and then <laughs> we're gonna shop till. Yeah, and there's no more mortgages left on our houses, so it's gonna be a fun day. Good morning, guys. This is the second time I've told you good morning. We're now here with Cameron again. Where are we eating at, buddy? Holidays. Are you excited? No. Canyon, what up, dude? What's up? Hey, the up. viewers haven't heard from you in a while, Cameron included. So, fill them in. Maybe give some insight on the day. What's up with life? What's up with the YouTube channel? What's up with fragrances? What's when you up work, with Gene Ellie. Well, I sell myself so on the day. Okay. Woman likes it. Lamale Parfum. You know, when you work at Wilson Art, you work every day of your life. So. Yep. Amen. That's why you just quit like I did. <laughs> he quit his job to be at the Bristol Night Race. I'm sure y'all watch that video. Anyway. Um, oh, okay. Well, hopefully it's... Oh, well, thanks, bud. Oh. Fit check. Uh, fit check. We got, fit check. Hey, we got the famous uh, hoodie that he caught a possum in on Snapchat. And <laughs> jeans. Yeah. Uh, me, we got white shirt, flannel looking thing, gray cargos, and the gang back there. Oh, uh, and DJR hat. Oh yeah, DJR hat. We're not dead. I'm we got the whole goon, the whole Goonie squad back there. They just chilling. They just living their best lives. They got some, they got some color rush outfits on. But we're about to go. Hopefully the line's not too long to eat at Paula Deen's. And uh, me and Cameron, or we're talking some DJR plans for 2024. So stay tuned. We are having an absolute success. These are, yeah, you can see. We got Tootsie Rolls, Tootsie Pops. Cameron got himself a water, but I, I'm drinking it now. So that's fun. Um, we bought a little bit of stuff. Cameron got a Troy and Gabriella uh, Funko Pop because shout out to High School Musical. Uh, movies number one, two, and three. Um, but I think we're about to go over to a little bit different part of Pigeon Forge here in a few. <laughs> Going to change the pace a little bit. I did a taste. How, how, how are we doing today? We're doing good, man. Well, uh, you found anything yet? Not yet. Just still looking? There's some cool stuff from here. I think that. Yeah. Cameron got him a Troy and Gabriella Funko Pop. So. Shout out to Brandon Presley. Yeah. AP, baby. If he was here, he'd probably be wearing that thing right now. Loud and proud. Update. This place is slammed. Woo. We're here with Cameron. We just left Bath and Body. Shout out to a buy one, get one free sale because you got to love it. What do you think about this place? It's pretty busy today. Tanger Outlets. The Severe older Bell. I get, the more I hate shopping. And why is that? I don't like people. Interesting. He's a type four, by the way. He's an individualist and romantic. And I'm a type two. I'm a people. Like, let me help you out. Like, how can I help you, homie? But I like being by myself. Yeah, he's a big introverted guy. Big extroverted guy. That's what we balance each other out. We just be out here. But we walking around. I don't know where Cameron and his future wife and children are walking around uh, to. Cameron's right here. Or Canyon, my apologies. Cameron's future wife's walking around somewhere, though. She's something. Like Love's fake. Love's fake. Mm, hate to see it, but yeah, we still got plenty more of these outlets to explore. It's like one o'clock in the afternoon. This place is absolutely slammed. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. We got a much needed update, folks. It's more in the evening time now than it was before. Me and Cameron were still at Bath and Body the last time you guys got an update. Um, we have just set in some beautiful, beautiful uh, Veterans Day weekend traffic. Um, I guess Cameron and Pam were up there just scooting along the whole time. I don't know. Everybody, everybody's kind of feeling a little tired. I can just get get the get the general vibes. Everyone's kind of wore out, but we're going to Gatlinburg, so expect the pace to pick up. I think Cameron, Cameron said he's wanting to spend I think his entire uh, 2023 work paycheck on a, a vinyl store. So good luck to Cameron on that. He's also watching the Tennessee and Missouri game, so he's pretty embedded. But. Um, we're going to walk around, maybe eat, maybe go to some stores. Who knows? 
I mean, it's it's Gatlinburg, so all bets are off. Who knows what's going to happen? Um, but all we know is, is this place is absolutely packed, slam full. I mean, it's we just got to send it. Do it for day. We just had Johnny Rockets for the first time since he was like six. First time in a decade plus for me. Very very solid. Canyon, what's the plans for the night? Because I mean, we're we're wandering around Gatlinburg right now. Uh, but like it is freaking slam packed. Yeah. Here. I mean, there's probably 10 million people. Out here. Yeah, it's. I'm cool. I can probably just fall over. Oh, okay. Well, I. Rhonda Douglas Western. Oh, absolutely! Shout out to the, shout out to the fam. They're holding down the fort, setting up Christmas supplies at home. Shout out to Cameron James, just for everything he does for DJR. He's such just a light in everybody's lives, and it's it's amazing. So, um, we're just walking around, beautiful sights and scenes. Um. And we're just going to try to find some stores to go into, some stuff to do. Try to waddle through this crowd. It is absolutely chaotic right uh, now. But we'll keep trucking on. Is Cameron going to get it? Oh, you got it, buddy. Oh, come on. <laughs> Shout out to all the stuffed animals. I mean, they are really like some OGs. Also, uh, yeah, we found some really good stuff in here. I don't Three more chances. Three, two. Oh. <laughs> He's so close. All right. Anyways, Cameron, tell them about the uh, selection we found in here. Christmas shopping early. Yeah, we're not even. We aren't even two weeks. Oh, better not. I hope nobody saw that. We're not even two weeks into November, and we'd we be Christmas shopping. Um, we just be trying to get stuff for people. So, shout out to all the wonderful, amazing people in our lives that we love and care about so dearly that we're Christmas shopping for. So, I think we're going to go back to the cabin, probably hot tub, coat and zero it up. Last night here, got to live it up. But yeah, Christmas shopping. Shoulder to shoulder right now on rooftops. They sent out the. Um, this is crazy. There's so much going on right now. I don't even understand what's happening. This is insane. But we went up to the third floor of the rooftop restaurant and museum. Jason Aldean, country singer. Yeah, this is crazy. We just out here living our best life. In the 828. What about the 828? In the... 865. No, that's not true. Ah, Morgan Wallen. As you can tell, two years in a row, second second part of the Burn Down Tennessee vlog, and we are back at Goats on the Roof for the Goat Coaster. I don't know where Cameron went. What's up, baby? <laughs> <laughs> Got Michael. Um... But yeah, hey, hold on, hold on, hold on. Canyon, you remember putting your head in one of those goats right there for the fun? Yeah, it's like it was yesterday. It's the goat father himself, Cameron Dale James. The father. The goat father, Cameron James. Is that one's name Morgan Wallen, buddy? Oh, it's Cameron. Cameron the goat. This is Got the, oh, got the goat coaster. We got a bunch of different stuff. I love goats on the roof. It's such a happy place in the world. I believe, um, I believe Pamela is looking for some Christmas stuff because you know Christmas is here, so you naturally just gotta go Christmas shopping. But love this place. It's definitely very nippy outside, much more than it was August of 2022, 14 months ago. But it's still a grand old time. Good morning, guys. This is kind of the last hoorah, the last shebang. Um, we are out. Uh, woke up a little bit later than what we wanted to this morning. It's still like 9 o'clock. I got to get back to the web, write some papers, which at the time you're watching this video are hopefully both done and well. Um, but after Goats on the Roof last night, kind of went back, played the guitar a little bit, hung out, 
just relaxed with the fam. Really didn't do nothing too crazy. We were all kind of zoinked and tired. So we, uh, we just hit the hay, we called it out. But goodbye to the Christmas tree. And we're gonna try to just peace on out and get on the road and then we'll hit us, hit y'all with the outro. What is up guys, editor's note. It is several days later since the trip has come and gone. Um, we're still here. I promised you a formal outro and here the formal outro is. I've even gotten a haircut since the Tennessee video. So that's fun. But I hope you guys enjoyed this weekend's vlog. Um, appreciate all the love and support. Hope you all enjoyed Operation Burn Down Tennessee Part 2. Um, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Maybe we'll have a Part 3 or a Part 4 in the future. Who knows? Um, but like I said, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you all for your support. We'll be back on Sunday with another YouTube devotional. So be sure to tune into that. And uh, I'll see you guys very, very soon. God bless.